All right, this segment here, we're gonna do a quick run over on identifying voltage for uh, what voltage your blower is running and how to make sure the appropriate voltage is coming out of the pack to go to that blower. There is a uh, 110 volt and 230 volt blowers are in the, in the uh, industry today. And so the packs are equipped to be able to run both of them. Right, right now we run 230 volt blowers through all of our spas that come out of production but there has been 110s in the past and so since the pack is capable of running both we just want to make sure that you know how to identify if it's a 110 or a 230 volt blower and how to know which voltage is coming out of the pack. Very easily on the blower itself. Take a look here. It says 230 volt. So if it says 110 volts, 110, 230 is 230. Very simple. Your plugs are the same on either one. But when we come into the pack here, we're going to see where they go. And really the main difference is, is on a blower, this 110 has neutral that runs. And if it's 220, the neutral becomes hot. So there'll be two hots coming in. Now this pack right here, what we're going to do is we're going to zoom in on where the spades hook up for the power going to it. And I'm going to show you how to convert it over. So coming in, I'm going to find the neutral, it's sitting right here on line 2. So this is line 2 which is power coming in. I pull this spade off, plug it onto this line which is your neutral bar. So I go onto the neutral block, the neutral is a neutral and the, and the blower will run as 110. Pull it over, put it onto line 2, now it's going to have live power going to it and the blower is going to be running as 230 volt coming out of the pack. Very straightforward. The next one we have here is your gecko pack and it's going to do the same thing. We're just going to try to get zoomed in on the area we need to see. And we're going to come down from our blower, which is right here. We're going to see that line. Comes down, and right now, it's sitting on P49, which is in the ground, a neutral area. It is a neutral bar sitting right there. And P59, which is right down here, is going to run it for 230 volts. So I'm going to move that over to P39, and you're going to have 230 volts running out. The okay, reason we need to know this for the most part is if, you, if you're originally running a 110 and you come out and change over the blower and put a 230 volt in, obviously it's only going to get half as much power and it's not going to perform and we don't have a situation where you have to go back a couple times to try to figure out, diagnose why this blower isn't performing entirely. And if you're going to do it vice versa, have 230 volt going and you plug a 110 blower in most likely you're going to do some uh, severe damage to the electrical components within the 110 blower. Okay, that's it. We'll call it a wrap and on to the next segment.